everyone thanks a lot for tuning into my channel today i am going to be reviewing the l'oreal mac magic 12 bar foundation and i got the shade g5 um it looks like this and uh, it retails for about 595 for 30 ml of product um this is uh, 12 hour it says it's it lasts for 12 hour and uh, i have applied i wore it for six hours max but i wanted to see if it really lasts for 12 hours or no uh, or not so um i will be doing a wear test and uh, um i've applied this foundation at about 11 a.m and i will try my level best to let it rest there or let it sit there for 12 hours if not 12 hours at least 8 to 10 hours let's see we'll see we'll see if i can uh do this or not um it says it is uh first bright matte foundation from l'oreal paris matte without the flat uh it really is not a flat foundation foundation it does not uh make your face look flat it really has some texture uh i really love the finish of it i will show you in the demo then you will understand better uh okay let's jump in jump into the uh, demo and uh, i'll talk to you about this product in the demo i have applied a moisturizer and i'm going to be uh, applying some uh, sunscreen lotion too i'm not wearing any um, i'm not going to apply any um primer because i want to see how long it lasts on the skin uh, because it says 12 hours i just want some sun protection because i'm going out uh, so i want to i don't want to go bare face i mean i don't want to go out without any sunscreen so i am applying a sunscreen uh, this is by lotus by the way the lotus um, safe sun gel form sunscreen lotion it's matte i've taken uh, a pea size uh, of this foundation and i'm going to be um, applying it with this to be a small brush and uh, I'm just first I'm just applying it first I'm just taking it dotting it on my face yes, it's very dark for me I should have gone for a shade lighter medium coverage as you can see it almost covered my blemishes I've had this um, actually I have this blemish over here so it almost covered it so coverage wise it's really nice so that's the single layer of it and it almost covered all the blemishes that I have um, I don't think I should pile it up but I will uh, show you if we can build the coverage or not so I'm going to be applying another layer and uh, I'll show you um, okay I'll directly take the foundation on my brush this much and then I am going to be applying another layer of it to see if it can be uh, built buildable or not now you can definitely build the coverage it's, it's not looking cakey uh, yes you can definitely build the coverage of this foundation so whenever I um, I have used or applied this foundation I've never uh, you know uh, go for I've never applied a second layer of it because I think one layer is enough I think I don't need any concealer but we will see if we can apply I mean if we can use it as a concealer or not so I will um, use it on my under eyes to see if I can use it as concealer this much I will take then apply it on my eyes, under my eyes, not on my eyes, <laughs> under my eyes. Okay. Just
so it can be uh, can be applied as a concealer too as you can see it has uh, decently covered my dark circle and I have quite dark dark circle um, so it has decently covered it and I think I don't even need to set this foundation because it is matte and it's already set as you can see uh, I am going to be setting it on my t-zone because this is the place where I get most of the oil so I am going to be setting it with the MAC magic um, powder I'm not going to use the sponge they give in it, they provide in it I'm going to use this uh, brush only I'm just going to set the foundation on my t-zone that's it and a little bit under the eye as well because I don't want any crease so that's the finished look with uh, the foundation and as you can see uh, it is quite natural it gives natural finish and um, it is matte as I told you and it I think it even covers uh, the pores as well yes it did cover my pores and uh, um, the 12 hour line I cannot be sure about that because I I, I will try my level best to uh, let it rest there on my skin for 12 hours but I cannot um, you know I cannot promise anything uh, but uh, I will try I will try to you know wear it as long as uh, possible on um, the texture I, I really like the texture and uh, the coverage is medium to buildable uh, as you can see and the finish I'm, I'm just reading out the thing that uh, that's written over here um, the finish is semi matte as it says uh, I don't know it's not semi matte I, I feel it's completely matte it's not semi matte it's not semi matte uh, my face is looking dewy because I have applied highlighter here so uh, it's not semi matte it is matte it is straight up matte but it's not drying as of now it's not drying my skin uh, but but again I have applied a moisturizer um, so it's not drying because of that uh, long last I'm just checking on it uh, I will tell you later because uh, I'm just checking if it will last there for 12 hours or not uh, so uh, I'll see you in the 12 hour line or as long as I can wear line <laughs> if you know what I mean so it's almost four hours now I applied the foundation at 11 a.m. and it's 3 p.m. almost 3 p.m. so it's been four hours and I've already started getting oily on the sides of my nose and also on my nose so let's see how far the foundation will go so it is almost 6 p.m. now and uh, it's been 7 hours that I have uh, been wearing this foundation and I think um, it starts to <laughs> melt. Uh, it's pretty much um, intact uh, in rest of my face but on the sides of my nose uh, I'm getting so much oil and uh, it's because I have very oily skin in my T zone, my T zone is very oily. Right, so it's 10:49 right now, um, almost 12 hours since I have been wearing this uh, foundation, and as you can see, uh, the foundation still is there, but my face is quite oily. Uh, so I would say it really lasts for 12 hours, but uh, as you. So my camera just died, and I had to film on my mobile uh, so just bear with me so uh, the foundation it really lasts for 12 hours I would say it lasts for 8 hours and uh, uh, it is blendable it's uh, it's very smooth on the skin it did minimize my pores and uh, it is water based so it will not clog uh, the pores and it will not um, you know break out this skin and uh, it gives matte finish uh, but it says it gives semi semi matte I would say it gives matte finish but it is not drying on the skin and uh, uh, what else um, 
okay um it's affordable <laughs> it is affordable and uh, um, it's uh, it gives very natural finish it is buildable it gives medium to buildable coverage and uh, yeah i think i sh i have covered uh, pretty much everything and uh, uh, i'm really feeling very tired now so i have to go wash all this off and go to sleep and uh, uh yeah that was my review on the uh, l'oreal true match it's not true match i'm just blabbering um that was my review on the l'oreal uh, mac magic um 12 hours foundation and uh, i hope this review was helpful for you and uh, uh, do subscribe to my channel if you like my videos and i'll see you soon in my next video bye bye